Hello, Wayne Baron for Dark Effects TV. Here to bring you a quick instructional video in Sony Vegas. Okay, this right here is using the uh, the crop tool. Okay, the event pan and crop. What we're going to do here is that this most people might know this or may not know this or might end up running into this situation and trying to pull their hair out, trying to figure out how they got there. So what I'm referring to is see how you're able to scroll around like you're able to move that block wherever you want it at however if you go over here where it says move freely x or y which this is your x and y axis you can click on it which allows you to move only in the x axis click on it again y axis and then x and y axis but what if you accidentally without knowing click on the x-axis and then you wonder why you can't move it you can stretch it you can make it smaller you can do whatever you want to with it but you cannot move it in the y-axis only in the x so you go over here you click and you can move y but you cannot move in the x so it's got to be where your arrows are pointing in all four directions in order to freely move anywhere you want. So um, I accidentally clicked this and didn't know how to get out of it. Then all of a sudden I got back. I mean, I'd seen it over here, but I never really paid it any attention. And I clicked on it. I think it was two days ago. So for the last two days, I've been doing this number right here. Or no, I think it's been the, the y-axis. Yeah, but I haven't been able to move, so I've been having to do this, and my videos haven't really come out the way I want them to come out. So anyway, just thought y'all might want to know that one, just in case you ever run into this issue, or you ever need, for whatever reason, to have access to either the x or the y-axis by itself, instead of having full access so anyway y'all have a rocking new year stay safe if you must drink find somebody to drive you all right take care of wayne baron see y'all in 2013 dark effects